Hey, what's up everyone and welcome back to the channel. Today's story is royal. Let's go. Meghan Markle may live to regret declaring war on the British media. At some point, Meghan Markle will come to regret initiating legal action against Associated Newspapers Limited. What probably looks like a low-risk attempt to silence critical media coverage of her and Prince Harry has quickly become more trouble than it's worth. Meghan Markle scored a small victory for her friends, but how long will that last? Granted, she just scored a small victory, not having to release the names of her five friends, who are likely as not carried out Meghan's wishes, gave her fan club something to cheer about. The judge has already hinted that Meghan Markle won't be able to protect her friends' identities if she calls on them to give evidence. At trial, that is a price that may have to be paid in the interest of transparency. In other words, she's in over her head. The case judge is no fool. He knows the games Meghan Markle plays in the media. The entire case was a badly thought out warning shot designed to dissuade other media outlets from taking a negative stance on either Meghan or her husband, Prince Harry. What the Duchess of Difficult didn't bargain for was the legal process shining a spotlight on the underhanded and devious tactics she seems to use to control her own public image. Nor does she count on the fact that Mr. Justice Warby is no fool. He sees right through the games she is playing. He said on Wednesday, Both sides have demonstrated an eagerness to play out the merits of their dispute in public, outside the courtroom, and primarily in media reports. Narrowing his criticism specifically to Meghan Markle and her legal team, he said they have been energetically briefing the media about these proceedings from the outset. The judge didn't stop at claiming Meghan has been using the media to further her cause. He highlighted the role of Omid Scooby, Meghan's apparent confidant. Scooby is the author of Finding Freedom, which Markle's supporters insist on claiming is entirely neutral and written without Meghan or Harry's input. Will texts from ex-BFF lay bare the real Meghan Markle? And that's not all. For all of the Sussex squad's insistence that the tabloids maliciously make up gossip about Meghan Markle out of whole cloth, it would appear not everything published about her is without foundation. Mr. Justice Warby confirmed the veracity of an article claiming that private texts and emails between Meghan and former BFF Jessica Mulroney could be exposed. And if those texts are exposed, you can bet the truth about the real Meghan will inevitably spill out. One has to wonder if Meghan foresaw any of this happening the day she decided to initiate legal action. It would be ironic if Meghan undoing came about as a result of her own behavior rather than at the hands of the evil British media. <laughs> Alright guys, very interesting article with a lot to take in there. But I hope you enjoyed it. Please give me a like, subscribe and leave a comment. I'll see you tomorrow. Thank you for watching. Goodbye for now.